cakes the chef fast but show you ready to learn Cooking is a lesson, light it up, let it burn It's time to slice and dice, chef, keep it tight, alright Now it's time to begin, it's really your sit down, your school is in class. Hey lads, how are you on this week? We're doing Gangster Chef Aspen Special Edition Wheat Section. This week we're going to make hot chocolate and almond biscuits roasted in the oven. Okay, we're walking down the street and there was this hippie. And the hippie come up to us and she sold us this bag of stuff. And it's called Happy Herb. And we've got some of it, as you can see in the bowl. Okay, this happy herb you can do with any kind of herbs, rosemary leaves, anything to um, infuse into our drink. So we're going to get that, simply just chuck it in the pot and then pour milk in. and turn it on to a low heat. Okay, now we're going to stir it up and put the lid on. And now we're going to make our almond biscuits while they cook. So we will turn on our oven now to about 190 degrees and um, pre-warm the oven while we get the almond biscuits ready. Okay, now we have a sheet of puff pastry that we got up from Coles and it's got plastic on the back. Leave the plastic on, put it on a chopping board, and cut in half. Because we can only fit half on the chopping board, so that's a bigger half. So we're going to do a couple, but we're only just making this one to show to you. So now I've got um, icing sugar in a bowl, and I've got an egg. I just want to, I don't want the yolk, I just want the egg whites in there. Now mix that in. And then mix that up. From the effects of the drug war and many mm, current and yeah. past leaders of that. Okay, so we mixed it up and she's a bit runny, so we're just going to add some more ice and sugar and slowly adjust it so that we can get it to its nice and thick but runny still. Okay, now it's at a perfect. Um, thickness, it's not too runny, but it's not too dry. So then we're going to get this and tip it onto the plate up before that. We have to take the plastic off because it's no good cutting this up and then trying to get the plastic off. So we lay it down, then we tip a little bit on there. Then we get a spoon or a spatula and we just run that all over the pastry. Okay. Now we get slivered almonds and the just sprinkle them over the, the pastry. Which is a great deal of what's happening in Mexico right now. They have more nice and evenly. From the US it's illegal to and we have some cinnamon and sugar mixed up, or we're just going to sprinkle over the top. And then we're going to get a knife. Cut it in about one and a half centimetre slices 
down the pastry and then in the thirds we're then going to get an egg flip pull them apart some of them might need a little bit of a cut and then place it on some baking paper on a tray leave a little bit of a gap so when they expand and puff up with cooking that they don't stick together. Now they are on our tray, we'll chuck them in for about 15 minutes. So just keep an eye on because they're going to puff up and then go golden. Once they're golden, we want to take them straight out. Took it off half the heat and just sitting there letting it simmer. I gave it another quick little smell. You can really smell those herbs coming out now. She's going to be a good night tonight, boys and gentlemen. Okay, we just gone and had a little sesh. It's been about 15 minutes now and the biscuits are cooked we just caught them in time one just got a bit cooked up one end but see they're puffed up nicely there and they look nice so and also we've had this simming it away and as you can see now all the stuff from inside the stem and the leaves has come to the top of the mill that's what we want so we're gonna now strain that into a bowl get all the stuff out okay now we're going to press all that in get as much juice out of it as we possibly can so there's a lot of juice you just want to get that all in there then we're going to get some Cadbury's chocolate drinking powder and we're just going to mix that in, just a couple of big spoonfuls. And now we're just going to whisk it up, so the hot chocolate is looking really good now. Mum's gonna love her hot chocolate this week when we give it to her. And then pour it in a nice jug so when she cools down, you can have some more later on. Okay, now we get our almond biscuits, two on the plate, get a little cup, pour in our hot chocolate you can put a bit of cream on that if you like and we're just going to get a little bit of ice and sugar sprinkle it on and like a Twenty-six years of my life, I never met her till a van on tour Where I found that berry treasure, janky joints, Moroccan specials Carry on, go forth, Kingswoods, I'm puffing on a Gabatron blowtorch Cooking up these cookies, but it's mashed in the butter hash Took a bite and laughed, then I dashed in my hovercraft That conductor cat on a sunny day, roller coast and feed the weed engine On my runaway locomotive, list of Ben Botanist Speaking out a herbal story, stargaze from my caboose Greenhouse observatory, chuffing